Hey everybody, welcome back to Going Ballistic. We're back out on the shooting range and here is what we have for you guys today. We had one of our subscribers suggest how many roof shingles does it take to stop a bullet? So we have 52 roofing shingles here. Nice, beautiful roofing shingles. And here's the rounds that we're gonna do. We're gonna do a 22, a nine mil, 223 green tip, 556 EP round, 308 EP round, 308 AP round, 50 BMG silver tip. So what we're gonna do for you guys first, we're gonna shoot the 22 and nine, and then we'll come look at them. We'll shoot the 223, 556, come look at them. Uh, the two 308 rounds and then the 50 cal, and then um, look at all the damage from those. So we don't wanna, shoot one, take a look at it, and waste all y'all's time. So that's what we got for you guys today. First, a word from our sponsor. Hey everybody, this video is brought to you by Olight. Olight has come out with a couple awesome new products. The first product I wanna show you is the Baldor Pro R. It's a rechargeable green laser light with up to 1,350 lumens and a 200 meter beam distance. It has a three position selector ring where you can have white light only, green laser light beam only, or you can have the white light and green laser beam combo. It has a magnetic port that serves also as a connection port for a remote pressure switch. A quick attach release and mounting system enables instant installation or removal. It's also compatible with both Glock and Picatinny size rail with provided adapters. The second new product they got is the i3T Plus. It delivers max 250 lumens output Perfect for taking care of everyday tasks. With two widely available AAA batteries, it runs up to 28 hours at 15 lumens. Slim body for easy holding and inspection of narrow spaces. The non-slip tail switch quickly turns on and off the light or shifts modes. With the two-way pocket clip and a lanyard hole, you can clip it securely or hang it around your wrist. Olight is having a huge Black Friday sale with up to 50% off select items and 15% off site-wide. The sale is only going on from November 24th to the 29th. So act now and you can get free shipping on all orders over $29. The new register benefits are a $10 off coupon over a $59 purchase and a $15 off coupon if you spend over $99. You will also get a free keychain light, the i1R2 Pro with the purchase of any item. So click the link down in the description below and start your Christmas shopping today. Thanks a lot, everyone. All right, first round up is gonna be a 22, standard velocity, it's right around 1,050 feet per second. We're gonna go to the top right. Well, let me chamber it first. Clear. All right, now we're gonna do a Glock 9 millimeter. And we're gonna go right next to that one, maybe. Clear. All right, I think we're good. All right, 22, nine mil, let's see. So we got one, eight, nine. Where'd it go then? <laughs> Cause that's the end of it for that one. Nope, it isn't. 10. And um, no, it's gotta keep going. It does not. So where the 22 round went, I don't know. It stopped on basically nine. Uh, it just kind of turned to dust. It was just a standard velocity lead round. But we got 11, 12, 20, dang, 21, 2, 23. And there it is right there. 24, stuck in the 25th, push through. And that's the 27th right there, so here we go. Wow, I didn't think they'd go that far through. I really didn't. There it is. So if our 223 goes through, we'll go ahead and cut these shingles in half and then stack them up, and that'll give us twice as many shingles. So moving on to the 223 and 556. Five, Let's do it. All right, now we're going to do the 223 and 556. Five, Green tip followed by the EPR. Get in there. We had stacked up a lot more shingles because uh, we were kind of surprised at how far the nine mil, nine mil went. And obviously 5.56 five, is going know, almost three times as fast. So, all right, here we go. Plug your ear holes, Chris. <laughs> ah, just kidding. Damn it. So here's where Justin hit. This was the green tip here and the EP round right here. 
This was 45 um, shingles stacked right here. So I'm just gonna flip these forward, see if they made them that far. Oh, well, I guess we didn't have to split them so much because they didn't. But let's go back. Well, there's one right there. So the EP round actually did make it to the 45th shingle. And the green tip right here, there's a bulge on the back of the 42nd, 43rd. Oh, here we go. We got some sticking through. Sticking through here. Oh, it's folded out. Oh, there you go. Oh. I think that was the green tip. Was this a green tip? I think I went left or right. Green tip EPR. Well, yeah, opposite of what you said. Oh, okay. Well, I apologize. I thought Justin shot the opposite way, but he didn't. And the EP round is designed to break up a little more. So let's go ahead and find that. So this is the EP round. I apologize. This is green tip EP round. So it did break up as it was designed. Took that little chunk with it. There's one piece of it. There's a third piece here that was pretty even. So there's our main chunk. Again, it just looks like a bunch of tar, but here is a third piece. All right. So those went uh, about as twice as far as the nine mil and um, the 22. Surprisingly, I didn't expect them to go that far, but we're gonna do the 308 now with the EP and an AP. So let's see what those do. So we're gonna be shooting the EP and then AP out of this M1A. Obviously it's 308. And uh, this thing has some issues cycling. And I'm definitely not gonna drop this one because it's not mine. Or maybe I will drop it because it's not mine. Here we go. Hopefully it cycles. Hey, it cycled. Good job, buddy. Yeah. All right, so EP, AP. So we're gonna do the same thing, just flip the 45 tiles forward. Oh, look at that. They went farther. Right neat. here. <laughs> that is pretty neat. All right, 46, 47. This is 60. Huh? Is this the end of our AP? No, let's just go to the end. <laughs> well, they both made it all the way Jeez. through. Okay. <laughs> so here is the EP round and there is the AP round. Um, yeah, that hit our steel plate in the back pretty hard. So those things would have blown through. That was, I believe, about 75 shingles there. Well, let's see if it even blew through the back of our plate. I doubt it. No, that was that was a different one. So it did not go through the plate. There's a half inch piece of steel. Yeah. But that's pretty cool. I did not expect that. Well, we're going to snap more of these apart and get on with the fitty. Let's do it. <laughs> Don't do that again. <laughs> hit you in. <laughs> Why? I'm going to hit you in your apple bag. <laughs> All right, like we always say, safety third. We got our blast shield up for the 50. And uh, well, we're gonna be shooting this silver tip. That reminds me, Chris, you mind bringing me a fire extinguisher? Just in case we start a grass fire. Perfect. Now we're ready. Just shake it. Yeah, I guess it's gonna have to. Yeah, right on all over my other firearms. Thanks. <laughs> no problem. Y'all ready for this? All right. Ugh. Kind of an awkward angle here. I'm hoping we can get through all these shingles. All right, let's send it. Oh, good Lord. That was a good one. Clear. Oh, bipod collapse. Let's check it out. Okay, this was 156 tiles. We broke them all down, lined them all up. So we're just gonna see what this, ooh, that started getting. Big in a hurry. Whoa, that's cool. Oh, we're slowing down, Justin. Gotta find that core. Oh, now started angling up. Oh, it's going up pretty dang quick. There it is, right there, buddy. <laughs> She's a beaut. She's a beaut, Clark. 
Isn't that neat, Justin? It's pretty neat. Holla, doll. It backwards. It did, didn't it? The way it tumbled and then freaking ended up backwards. Hmm. That's awesome. So how many was there? A lot. <laughs> I guess we'll count later. We'll be right back. We're going to count these. Seven, eight. Take your shoes off. It took us about six hours, but we got them counted. It went through 114 shingles. Do not use shingles as body armor. It's really bad and really heavy. <laughs> okay, well, 22, nine millimeter. It only takes a whole pack to stop it. That's what we got for you guys today. But thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to pick up your $10 t-shirts. These are good quality t-shirts. Click the link down in the description below to check out our t-shirts. Thank you to our patrons. We really appreciate that extra mile you guys go to support this channel. Thank you guys for just viewing it. Click that subscribe button. Help us hit that 200,000 subscriber mark. But thank you everybody and we'll be back. Man, I'm really glad we didn't have to use these fire extinguishers. These things are That's what happens when you leave stuff on the range, people shoot it. They're hard to use this way. <laughs> hmm. Yeah, at least we got it for next time.